Boris Johnson has been sent a huge Brexit warning after being told UK fishermen face two looming crises that could cripple the already under pressure industry. Under the Brexit trade deal agreed by the Prime Minister at the end of last year, the European Union's share of the catch from British waters will fall by 25% in stages over the next five years. Following the end of that fishing transition period in June 2026, both sides will hold talks annually to discuss access. During the negotiations with Brussels, Boris Johnson insisted he would do everything he could to protect UK fishermen and insisted the country was taking back control of our waters, but UK fishermen have complained of having to desperately fight their way through endless bureaucratic red tape that has smothered them in the six months since the trade deal was agreed. Alistair Carmichael, who has been the Liberal Democrat MP for major coastal constituency Orkney and Shetland for the past 20 years, has issued a call for evidence ahead of a parliamentary debate on the impact of Brexit on the fishing industry on July 13. In a warning to the Prime Minister the worst is yet to come for the sector, he explained to Express.co.uk, the biggest problem for the UK fishing industry is still to hit and that is what they call in-year quota swaps. Boris Johnson secured a quota which was higher than the base we had in the common fisheries policy but lower than we actually got because we bought in or swapped quota with other EU countries. With North Sea Cod, our entitlement under the old rules was 52%. Boris Johnson had come back with 57%, but that previous 52% we had pushed up to 62% and because you are out of the EU, you don't have access to private quota swaps like that. There is no provision in the deal for in-year quota swaps. Downing Street has said they can do all of this government to government rather than fishing boat to fishing boat, that was in January and we're now in July and yet there is still no clarity on this. He added, the other looming crisis is in the availability of labor for fish processes. I spoke to one in Peterhead and he said HES constantly 10% down on where he needs to be for his workforce. He either can't process some fish despite having a market for them, or pay the remaining workforce overtime, which eats into his profitability.